Yes, I'm Jazz Ward. I'm the director of this rendition of Gruesome Playground Injuries, and this is Owl. Um, the play is just so heavy about connectivity, so heavy on like just timing of relationships and also just like the longevity of them as well that I was really drawn to and also just the layers of like the internal and mental pains that like we go through as people but also how you always will have that like that like little birdie on your shoulder from your past or something that reminds you of like who you are just that person who keeps you grounded and yeah yeah what are you most excited for in this production <sighs> i'm really excited for like just to be doing it like it's my first time directing so just like dipping my toe into that water um and just like just like i don't know having it being consumed as well by like my friends or even like being able to have like my peers and my close friends being a part of like the cast and the crew and all these other parts like having finding like it, that it's very clear how like community and networking not even how it works but just how it like pays off in your benefit to be a nice person and also like being a creative and like having people enthused to work with you and like enthused to like be a part of it in any way possible like i think like that is something that's very beautiful to me but also like i'm very excited to like be the person spearheading this and like making sure that like all aspects are being taken care of with like love and grace and like all those things oh, and why this specific production of gruesome playground entries now yeah. true i specifically i'm doing this like version very clear um like i mentioned before uh i did it with a cohort mate She's a girl, I am a girl. And I really like just the story I think it told. For it to be queer, I feel like being queer in general is very a very nuanced experience. And it's also something that is, to me, in my life, very effortless. I guess like kind of adding on to what I was saying before in terms of like relationships, like I guess where I'm in my life, this has like been a big year for me in like friendships and really expanding on the people that I know and being very intentional with that. And so like when this show is like all about relationship and all about the things that you go through and how traumas can be accumulated. But if you have like those the right people beside you, like it can ease it sometimes. And so I think just like combining those two things and those are both things that I'm very passionate about. Like I think this show is can serve as just a very gentle and realistic blueprint of what it is to I don't know live your life for yourself but also knowing that you have a village who's always like with you regardless if it's platonic romantic whatever like just being there for one another and i think we could all use a little bit more love and a little bit more i don't know soft spottedness for each other especially in today where i feel like there's a lot of emphasis on like violence and emphasis on hate in so many aspects like having a show that just even though it's a hard show and a tough show it's real and it's very like relatable in a way thank you, Boom. Thank you.